But now, wow, look at my smile. It looks different. It looks so different. Like, ah, my braces are over, girl. I got my braces in August 2017. I'm getting braces today. As you can see, I have my braces on. It went really quick. I was so surprised. Like, I didn't feel any pain. And I'm gonna go back in six weeks basically no chewing and biting biltong dried sausage hard dried fruit hard toast hard bread pizza crust ice lollies bones i don't eat meat so that's gonna be fine no eating nuts popcorn i've had my braces for three weeks three weeks guys and Three brackets have already come undone. I had a rice cake. My teeth have moved so quickly. Like I used to have a gap in the center as well. And now it's closed and this side just looks awesome. The last time I went for an ortho appointment, I couldn't eat anything for three days. So now I'm just going to make sure that I stuff everything into my mouth, especially bread and peanut butter because I won't be able to chew any toast. Yes. So. <laughs> oh my word! So I just got my new bands and I'm so happy because I asked him how long it's still going to be because I have had my braces for two years now. And he initially said a uh, year and seven months or 14 months, I can't remember which one. So this August, it's going to be my brace anniversary. This has been brutal. He said not long now, it's either the, the next two or three visits, so... Today is supposed to be the day that I get my braces off. When I looked at my braces this morning, I didn't think that I would be able to get it off. Um, but we'll see when I get to my ortho, fingers crossed. Initially, it was supposed to be one year and four months. It is now three. <laughs> so, I just got back from my ortho. And I'm so happy. Look at my smile. I'm literally so happy. Okay, so I quickly want to walk you through to the process. Through the process. It's so weird not having that lisp from my braces. Um, I remember a while ago someone had asked me if braces does um, give you a little bit of a lisp. And um, initially when I, when I had my braces put on, I didn't notice it. Like after the first year, I realized that I did have a lisp. Um, and then it was obviously difficult to speak. But now, wow, look at my smile. It looks different. It looks so different. The process was really easy. I'm, I watched so many videos where people were talking about how uncomfortable, how like painful the process was of removing your braces. And the worst part was that it was loud. Like there wasn't a scratchy feeling I, like i literally didn't feel anything maybe it's just because my teeth are like really strong now in the past i felt like i had sensitive teeth but i literally didn't feel anything it wasn't uncomfortable so he basically filed my teeth he didn't whiten my teeth at all so it's still my natural color i probably won't whiten my teeth oh so I wanted to film the removal of my braces, but I couldn't because it's the pandemic now and it's really intense when you go into the practice. It looks like there's literally no one there. The couches have been removed. The admin lady was kitted out with a suit. It looked like those proper isolation suits. I had to sanitize my hands before I went into the room and then every single time I had to rinse my mouth I sanitized again which is right like I completely agree with that not that I'm saying I don't know the gravity of the situation but seeing him cover like that was like really intense so I'm gonna make sure that I'm 
at home home for the rest of this period until everything ends there's no more coronavirus and um, people are living life like they normally do i don't have my retainer yet so i still have to get that um, i'm gonna go pick it up in the next few hours um, I haven't eaten anything yet, so I don't know what that's going to be like. My my teeth feel really weird. It feels like like glossy. <laughs> I can still feel my gums are swollen. So once that kind of uh, the swelling goes down, then I'll insert the picture of what it looks like after a couple of hours, or maybe the next day. Yes, I think I'll do that. <laughs> <laughs> so I just phoned my author to say that my left incisor, yes I'm sure it's my incisor, it looks a little bit longer. I wanted to let him know before my retainer is made, while my retainer is being made right now. But I wasn't sure if that was going to affect like what my retainer looks like. Um, so he said no it doesn't affect the retainer really and then I must just be patient because obviously my teeth need to set and it has, like it hasn't even set yet and I'm concerned hey do my teeth look straight enough I'm just gonna do this then you can see so it probably looks like really normal to you but obviously I've been like zooming into it looking in the mirror at every single tooth and just to see like whether it's perfect so i'm gonna eat my first meal now i know that it's not anything special but it's just basically um some bananas and i've got almonds in here i've got um coconut flakes and pumpkin seeds and flax seeds and what else is in here a whole bunch of seeds and nuts so my teeth are being put to the test now <laughs> It's like I'm afraid that I'm gonna break a bracket. <laughs> I'm so used to rubbing my tongue against my teeth so I can remove any food that's stuck in my brackets. So every time I eat, I'm doing this now. <laughs> and I don't have to do that anymore. Just got back from my ortho and I got my retainer. I'm wearing one of them right now. That's why I can't really speak properly. Um, I'm going to show you what my retainer looks like and I'm going to go through what he explained to me. Like I said, it sounds a little weird now that I'm speaking because I'm wearing my retainer. Uh, you can't even really notice it because it is clear as well. But I'm speaking weirdly because it's the first time I'm wearing it. I have two retainers and I'll quickly show you what it looks like. So this is basically what it looks like, it's clear, it's basically just a mold of my top teeth and to ensure that my teeth don't move. The rules that apply to these retainers are firstly that I don't lose it, <laughs> um, that I wear it for six weeks after having my braces off so right now I need to wear it um, for six weeks like I was wearing my braces. Um, especially at night so i only take it out when i'm eating and obviously like when i'm brushing my teeth don't eat with it and he said don't suck it that's the biggest thing because some people suck it and i don't know what they do with it that makes it weird and uh, so basically if i want to remove it all i do is i push the retainer down from my gum to my teeth and it comes out And then put it in back in he said just be patient because your teeth obviously need to set and once my teeth set then um, he'll see if he needs to file it again he does want to do it now because he doesn't want to file my teeth too short and I 100% agree with that I said to my ortho now I'm not gonna close my mouth I want my money's worth <laughs> Like I will be laughing the whole time. I'm really, really happy. Oh, the way that I need to clean my retainer is basically that I brush it on the inside and the outside. Um, but I either use cold or lukewarm water. 
and this is the second one for the top uh, he just gave me two just in case um <laughs> in case i lost it my lips not as thick anymore on top and even though i don't have braces at the bottom i never ever had braces at the bottom um i feel that my teeth at the bottom are fairly straight enough um that i didn't need to have them also my ortho knew that my biggest goal was just to close the gap that i originally had yeah i'm just so so happy